see the leaves on the trees. They look so pretty, don't they, when they're changed in colour? And yeah, look, Steve is kicking through the leaves. Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. on the bus and we was like whoosh we didn't realize how windy it was three months ago we had that four degree i know it's just crazy isn't it but then again we can't complain it's a nice summer you know really really was yeah so boys went off to school absolutely fine what do you mean what's my they have haven't they don't know what they all are but anyway yeah boys went off to school absolutely fine this morning obviously the Bus company did apologise for yesterday. We said that's absolutely fine. Couldn't be helped, could it? And they did. And they was grateful that actually we went and picked them up because they actually said even though we went and picked them up, they still got stuck in the traffic, didn't they? Because there's nowhere for them to turn around. But yeah, so like I said, can't be helped. But yeah, so this morning we're just popping off to the post office. Got a parcel to send off. Yesterday, the post office. Let's say the post office. The postman collected all the parcels, but he forgot this one. For some reason, oh yeah, because see, a little bit of tree is falling down. So yes, off. What? I wonder why that's. Yeah, I wonder that did fall from. So anyway, yeah. So we can send it off now, and then obviously when we get back home, we've got a few jobs to get done in the house as well. We see what's going to the garage. We've got a whole more things to look on the eBay. See what's get that done. They have actually. Yeah, it's just like basically um, when somebody had a declutter, isn't it? Yeah, so if anyone wants any DVDs or anything, come on the website. I've got on, on the eBay store. I mean. They're only a pound each starting price. So. Exactly. Yeah, it's all kids' DVDs basically. It's like, isn't there? I think we have DVDs got. DVDs are still worth having, guys. You know, but when Ben goes out in the car, he has a little mini DVD player that keeps him distracted. It does, doesn't it? When you've got one of them, you don't have to worry about internet signals or nothing. We don't, do you? So yeah, yeah. so we're going to try and get that done as well, and possibly if I get time, I'm going to try and restart really doing my. Disney Castle. So yeah, so that's our first job is post office. And I also want to see how quickly how they're getting on with these um, retirement flats. Yeah, so basically all you can see is they've just cleared the land. They just left the toilet. <laughs> yeah, they just left the toilet up. <laughs> I know, yeah. It's quite a sad seat not down though, isn't it? Yeah, they should build something decent on there, like put an Audi on there or something. Should do. But what I think is funny, they're putting retirement or people's places here and then behind there school it's a school field and, uh, what, um, what, what you, um, the school house they do don't they which is quite funny actually so yeah but, um, really? on the other... honestly can you imagine an Audi I can actually yeah uh, but what I think is funny is the other side of um, town they've got an old people's um, care home up there and they're putting a skate, kid's skate park up there. It just, it just boggles, doesn't it? All these people want probably rest and relaxation, peace and quiet. Um, I'm not too quite sure actually that one of there is. But anyway, yeah, so I'm um, obviously then going to have noise from the skate park. But it's just crazy how, them, how they plan these things out, isn't it? It really is. So you can see the leaves on the trees. They look so pretty, don't they, when they're changed in colour? And. Yeah, look, Steve is kicking through the leaves. Oh, take you back to your childhood. <laughs> so, yeah, and see, town's quite quiet again, actually. But how do how do trees know what season it is? Because something to do with the chlorophyll or something, isn't it? Yeah, look at this lot here. Eee. 
Is it the chlorophyll? Something like that, isn't it? I don't know, it could be bleach rather. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So, it looks so pretty though, doesn't it? Something to do with the nights. It is something to do again. Look at the wind. The darkness is more longer than the daytime. That's when they know. Oh, is it? Or oh, something like that, isn't it? So, yeah. But yeah, it looks so pretty with all the leaves and... They are now, aren't they? In a couple of weeks, they'll be even longer. I oh, know, so they won't be able to come over from school on this trampoline because it'll be dark. Yeah, that'd be nice. Oh yeah, what with the kids? That'd be funny. And just think, before we know it, all these lights up here will have all the all the lights, all the trees have all the lights in for Christmas, wouldn't they? Have they still got them in? Have they? Yeah, Or somewhere. I suppose that's. Oh yeah, I can see there's a wire. Oh yeah, I suppose it makes sense to keep them in there. I'm quite surprised some person didn't go around chopping them all off. It worked right. She looks like I hate, I hate my hair because my sideburns grow like Elvis. They do, don't they? <laughs> so, not really. At least you've got yours done now. It's out the way. So, then on Saturday, we can get the boys done. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, do you fancy hot chocolate or something? Yeah, we'll go for a drink. Yeah. yeah? Because don't forget, Costa are doing that thing with Vaseline where you can get a free drink, aren't they? Oh, I'm not having that. You're not having like that. A poxy little thing, isn't no, it? Yeah. yeah. So, you might as well pop into Costa. I haven't been to Costa for a while, actually, to be honest with you. Since we've been back finished it, we've been quite busy actually to be honest with you. Steve's been in the garage putting a few things on eBay, give a good old tidy up as well. Um tell what we're gonna have to do, darling. Next couple of weeks we're gonna have to go through all that Christmas stuff and see what we've got in there, aren't we? See what we need. But you said I don't need no wrapping paper because she said you found about twenty rolls still sealed. I think because we've got a whole load in the cell, I think it'll probably so that's probably what I was anyway, yeah. It's crazy to think the tree's gonna go up next month, isn't it? Like I said, we've got the space for it already. It is going in this corner for now, isn't it? Unless we can get hold of a TP or free safe or something. But we'll just have to cross that bridge when we come to it. But for now, it's definitely going there, yeah? Mm. It's out the way then as well, isn't it? Yeah, so finally got around and sorting out all the washing. Oh, no, it's just been piling by the door, just, like I said, just got round to it. It's one of those jobs you put off, isn't it? So, yes, yeah, so that's mine and Stephen's. This is Sammy's. I don't know why Sammy's got the bigger power for t today. Normally Ben has, and believe it or not, Ben's actually got the shortest pile. So, yes, I need to put that upstairs, put that way in their rooms. Again, Samuel, you've got Sammy to pull away. You'll just throw it in his drawers, and then he'll manage to kind of get a thing in his drawers. But obviously, put hollow clothes on the air, because I know, obviously, these won't dry that's actually tipping down with rain. Yes, yeah, so I'll just put a whole load in the washing machine as well, and I've just got some towels and stuff down there, which I'll uh, probably put in after. I've seen lots of bath the towels, I'll put them upstairs on the radiators, and also like the top of the stairs or the hallway, and then they'll be drying them for the morning. You can see the boys are home from school. Sam has gone straight upstairs. He has said hello to us, so he wants to go upstairs and play his games, which is fair enough. He keeps shouting out, Mummy! So I'm going to see him in a minute. But yeah, Ben's had a really lovely day at school too, ain't you, sweetheart? You had a lovely day at school. You see, he's just tucking into his what's-its, aren't you, sweetheart? Yeah, if only you could tell us what you've done at school, isn't it? Um, his teacher's put in his book, he's had a really lovely day. This afternoon, they've been talking about their hobbies and things I like to do out of school. And obviously, school now, but all our Merlin trips and days out. And they said he loved looking at the pictures of Warwick Castle and all the theme parks. But give Ben the choice between Warwick Castle and the theme park. I think he'll pick a theme park now. Before he would have been Warwick Castle, but he's gone such a thrill seeker. Ain't you, Ben? Ain't you, darling? Do you love all the rides? Yeah, you love all the theme park rides, don't you? I think your favourite rise would be Scorpion Express. Because obviously it's not open at the minute because they had the fire. So it's definitely the Gruffalo he likes. Sea Storm, and not too quite sure right. He likes at Legoland actually, to be honest with you. You like all of them at Legoland, don't you? Yeah. So at least you've had a good day, haven't you, sweetheart? Yeah, you had a really lovely day. Quite surprised if we didn't get a phone call come pick him up because, again, it's about quarter past 12 this morning, so if I went off to sleep, but I hope fingers crossed he sleeps better tonight, wouldn't you? Yeah, did you? Yeah, what's it's nice. 
Yeah, well, yeah, what's this nice? Yeah. Hey, are you all gone? Yeah, you went them all. Should we go and get your drink now as well? Hello, Samuel. Good afternoon. Good day? Yeah. Yeah, do anything nice at school? Yeah. What have you done then? I'm just been doing lots today. Yeah, was your teacher back today? I'll have math today. Yeah, well, she back. I oh, know. I forget you have two different teachers, don't you? They one does Monday, Wednesday, Friday. The other one does Wednesday afternoon, and Tuesday and Thursday, don't they? It's all confused how they work it all out and stuff. But you, you had a good day, yeah. Yeah. You see what we've done for you this afternoon? Clean the room. Cleaned your room for you again. Yeah. You know what? You're old enough and capable enough of tidying your room up yourself. Mm. But yes. you, but you are. A pain in the arm. <laughs> you can't say it. you're lazy. Lazy, aren't you? You're lazy for doing that, aren't you? Yeah, mummy, I think my. What's the matter with your tablet? It's crashed this time. Is it crashed? You're always crashing the tablet. Is that what we also also we found out for you? Yeah. What have we found out for you? Put them in your bed. Oh, we've got all my stuff. You got all your cushions back, haven't you? Yeah. Um. You got your pepper pig cushion. You had that special made when you were younger, and you, when Sammy was a baby, it's that whole sentimental value. Obviously, you've got your Olaf cushion because Sammy, as she can, as she probably wears, Sammy absolutely Mummy. loves Olaf. He's got his Butlins cushion, haven't you, sweetheart? Yeah. Wish what you got him from Butlins. Um, yeah, we'll come back. Fine stuff from Butlins cushion. You got your frozen pillow as well, haven't you? When you went on this first residential school, bless him, we took that with him, and then you've got your monster sink. Cushion there as well, yeah, haven't you? I found that song, Mummy. What song? Ready for the ride. Ready for the ride. We like that song, don't we? Oh, it's already lighted for my channel. Yeah. Daddy's sort your tablet out for you in a minute. All right. How come it's crashed anyway? What's it crashed on? It's working. Um, this the panner, the panner. You are. The screen. Okay. Because of that. Okay. We have to reset it. Daddy, I have to take it back to right reset it and reset it for you. Um, what was school dinner today? Um, it was beef burgers. Did you eat beef burgers? Yeah, that's one... still my favourite on the menu. What at is? School. What beef burgers? Still on the menu. Yeah, when I do beef burgers here, you don't like them. No, I like the school ones. Oh, that's charming. You don't like mummy's cooking, but you like the school ones instead. Yeah. Well then guys, yeah, as I end the vlog tonight, as you can see, I have a nice shave temple, yeah. Big thank you to Cutting Edge and Simon for another great job on my hair today. It's his birthday as well, he was all working, he was yeah. working on his birthday. Yeah, big happy birthday to Simon. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thank you so much for being such a good barber and such a good uh, barber to Ben as well. Because uh, if it wasn't for you, I don't think he would have ever got into a, into a barber's chair. <laughs> Remember the first time I got Ben's hair God blimey, I tell you, it's like pinning him down into the seat, that was. But now he's got bothered though, is he? Yeah, I'll never forget that. <laughs> Even Simon will never forget that, how he was squabbling. I think it helps because we go to the same barbers and we always get Simon to cut his hair. Yeah. I think that helps. Because yeah. he doesn't, he just goes straight for it, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so yeah, I got mine done today, so when I take them two on Saturday afternoon, I can just concentrate on getting Ben's hair cut and then getting straight out basically yeah well. sammy sammy doesn't matter it's just ben anyway yeah so today we got quite a few jobs done we uh went through sammy's room like a tornado basically didn't we and basically took out took out loads of clothes that don't fit him anymore put all of his clothes away properly into the drawers and everything else i said to Cheryl, you know i know it gets not um it gets depressing, shall I say, when you're doing things like that on your own. So I said to her, well, I'll help you do it, you know. Yeah. At the end of the day, we're man and wife, so we help each other out. So, and there yeah, we go. And we even found out some of Sam's old pillows for him, which is about money. Yeah, yeah. Just think of how long we'd be doing messages after dinner. And tomorrow afternoon, we need to go through Ben's clothes and put these clothes away. And yeah, all up to date then. So, yeah, so happy you days. Put, you put all the old Sam's stuff away every said goodbye for summer. Yeah, and I went through uh, all the old stuff we got in the garage. I put some more stuff on eBay. Yeah, uh, the link for eBay uh, is Discount Media Store, and it's in the description box below. So if you fancy any cheap media like DVDs, CDs, everything on there, some of it's only a pound each. There's loads of CDs I put on there today. So 
Yeah, yeah. yeah I'd be like one of those eBay sellers who have a YouTube channel, you know, basically say, oh, yeah, look, um, we're selling our old crap, basically. Yeah, <laughs> comment down below if you've got to use the CD because we've got Amazon Prime and obviously with the Hi-Fi we've got you can set up through Bluetooth can't we? Yeah. Um, I don't I don't listen to CDs anymore. Yeah. I was I always look up years all of these Amazon music. Hopefully it's for Sam is it, it won't work downstairs, will it? If there's only one thing that annoys me is in the car because oh, yeah. uh you know, I don't want to be playing with my mobile phone while I'm sitting on the steering wheel it trying to No, no. So anyway, digital radio is good enough for the car. I can't wait to switch it over to uh, Heart Christmas when we're, when we're travelling up and down because well, no, yeah, of the DAB. Yeah, don't forget that when we're out and about around Christmas time, you can switch it to Heart Rate, Heart Christmas. Well, yes, that was always was on there. The wedding when we messed around with it the other day. It's not going to be the Christmas song. Yeah. It's like, no. Anyway guys, yeah, that brings another day to a close, yeah, and uh, I'm so glad to get this hair off my head here, it was really getting on my nerves, but one thing that Simon did say to me, you've got a receding hairline at the top here, look, you see like, I tried to think when I get older, all, all this bit's going to be gone, I'm just going to have hair at the sides, <laughs> and uh, Shell's getting on with a uh, diamond art. I haven't finished it yet. <laughs> You didn't find out funny when I said that about me having a receding hairline. I know I did because I know it's I know, I know you've got a receding hairline. You've got some grey hairs in there as well. Oh, yeah. Anyway, like the video, comment down below, hit the you know what button, and we'll see you tomorrow for Thursday already. Bye guys. Bye.